Hopkinton High School defeated Canton by way of the sweep to claim the Division II Central sectional final. HCAM's Mike Terosian caught up with Hiller's head coach, Margie Grabmeyer, and some of the Hiller's players after the victory. All right. So, you just got yourself, you just got yourself a Central Division II championship, what do you think? Uh, awesome, words can't even describe this feeling. I'm so proud of the team and the effort that we put in this year. And, and what's next? You got a big uh, game coming up on the 16th? Oh yeah, we're just going to put a lot of effort and just keep playing the way we do. All right, so you're going to have a little fun tonight and then back to work yeah, tomorrow? Exactly. Right, way to go, good job. <laughs> just set it on the floor. And then you guys are going to sit there. What are we doing? Someone comes to the center. Yeah. Just won a little game here today. Yes, yeah, it's very exciting. <laughs> very excited. So uh, big big plans tonight? Uh, yeah, we're going to celebrate, hopefully. Get some food, yeah. We're really excited. <laughs> and then back to work tomorrow? Yeah, back to work tomorrow. Yep, no days off. <laughs> you know who you're playing yet? Uh, I don't actually know. I don't know yet. Yeah. Neither do I. Have it Wednesday, the game. Wednesday. Yes, Wednesday. We'll be there. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. All right. So uh, this is your second title in three years for uh, the division. What do you think? I think it's a testament to the sub-varsity program. These girls are working hard in the off-season, and they're developing before they get to varsity. So that's where the strength came from. This team is made up of a lot of girls that played on the junior varsity last year. So um, they're all working really hard. And that's why we're having the success right now. Excellent. So uh, you got to give the girls the night off and uh, back to work tomorrow? Um, tomorrow, Sunday? No. No. I didn't think so. Off. We got a day off. That's fantastic. Hopkinton went on to the state semifinals. The Hopkinton Hillers handed Amherst their first loss of the season in the Division II state semifinals on Wednesday, November 16th. Hopkinton improved to 21 and 2 on the season, while the Amherst Hurricanes fell to 23 and 1. Hopkinton defeated Medway via the sweep, Westboro 3 to 1 and Canton 3 to nothing to advance to the state semifinals to take on the West champion Amherst. Amherst went into the semifinals matchup having won every single set except two all season. The Hillers remained in control through the first two sets, taking set one 25 to 16, set two 25 to 19, Julia Canistrari lit up the scoreboard in the first two sets, scoring nine of the Hillers' points. Amherst struck back in the third set and pulled off the win, 25 to 17. Unbelievable. Weber, Canistrari's block still alive. The hit over by Gogol, and there it is. The hardest earned point in the history of high school volleyball. Momentum bounced back and forth throughout the fourth set, but the Hillers went on a late run to close it out, 25 to 23. Julia Canistrari knocked down the game-winning point for the Hillers. Number four, just to recap, the Hillers took set number one, 25-16. They took set number two, 25-19. Amherst took set number three, 25-17. And the Hillers trying to advance to the state finals, but they need one point, and Amherst only down by one. Hayes set to serve, trying to tie the set up. Serve to the back. Set up by Hassan Canestrari, and the Hillers are going to the state finals! Julia Canestrari clinching the victory for the Hillers as they take set number four, 25-23. The Hopkinton Hillers advance to the state finals to take on South sectional champion Notre Dame Academy, who stands at 21 and one. They will meet up Saturday, November 19th at Shrewsbury High School. Notre Dame Academy swept four straight matches to capture the Division II South Sectional Championship. The 2014 Division II State Champion Hopkinton Hillers will play Saturday to try to capture their second state title in the past three seasons.